Hello! Another Deus Ex trailer, sorry, where, where do we keep talking over ourselves at the start? I'm trying to say it in unison, so we're both saying hello at the same time. Oh, right. <laughs> this is uh, another Deus Ex trailer, but it's kind of slightly mm. weird. Look, it's real! It's more... What? Yeah. Oh my god, it's real! Um, it's real people! What the hell? I thought it was a video game, is it a movie now? What sort of augmentation would you like to have then, Lewis? <laughs> There's a lot of options, isn't there? You can have like a... I quite like the iron jaw. Really? An iron jaw? <laughs> yeah. Why do you want an iron jaw? It's, it's really, like, scary. You want to be scary? Well, no, people wouldn't know I had an iron jaw. It would be hidden underneath my, like, normal chin. And then you would rip off the fleshy covering of your chin and it'd just be metal and you could scare children with it. Is that the idea behind this? The eyes are quite cool. Um... Reports of human experimentation. And we have to ask the question, are we playing God? We've been integrating ourselves with technology for decades now, replacing damaged limbs with mechanical limbs, implanting data chips into our bodies, which give away huge amounts of information to governments and corporations all across the globe. At no point have they thought about the consequences of their actions. They actively encourage you to exchange your perfectly functional body parts for upgraded augmentations. What they are doing is ethically and morally wrong and they should be brought to justice. Growing numbers of people experiencing... Today, Seraph effects. Industries signed a new historic military deal. I know that they are creating uh, mass quantities of uh, military-grade augmentations. I've seen testing on them, and it's uh, very scary. Very scary types of alterations. They want to systematically turn us into machines and pump us full of their drugs. You have to take New York Cuisine. One of the most dangerous and addictive drugs that exists in the world today. You'll have to take this drug for the rest of your life. If you don't, your body will reject your augmentations. It's a drug that's priced so highly that we are now seeing cases of high-profile people who are now out on the streets and they are begging. They are begging for drugs. They'll have their technology in your body. They could have the power to turn off your limbs, the potential to turn off your eyes. They'll be able to send messages to your brain and control your thoughts as if they have the power. So the big thing is you have to take a special drug and you become a drug addict. See, that jaw augmentation doesn't seem such a good idea anymore, does it, Lewis? Oh god, it doesn't, does it? No! <laughs> this is terrifying! It's just the human revolution of the, uh, the the title. I think so. Oh yeah. My God. So if you, God, can you imagine if like oh. to have an iPhone, you had to like take drugs? That's what it's like. Pretty much, yeah. Except it's an iPhone that's part of your body, forever. Whoa. Just there. Eye legs. You'd be. You really. Eye chin. You'd be. <laughs> eye eye. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. You'd be really gutted if you got like the the eye nipple four and then two months later the eye nipple five came out. <laughs> You'd be like, oh <laughs> God upgraded at the wrong time.